Mm-mm-mm. Look at that. Ooh. Beautiful. Another real techniques. <sighs> Why is it when I need to say it, I can't say it, and then... <sighs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel today. I'm bringing to you my everyday makeup routine. Because I got out of the shower, I need to do my makeup. So I figured, why not film it for you guys? I already moisturized my face with this Open Glory moisturizer. I love it. So let's just start, I suppose. First things first. Foundation. I use the Bourjois Healthy Mix. Love it. I'm gonna put some on my Real Techni Ugh. the Real Techniques buffing brush. I like to use that for my foundation because I don't know. I just get a good coverage with. I feel. I just have a mirror here on my right. I think your left. Or right I'm not sure <laughs> so if you see me look in that direction right here it's because I'm doing my makeup in the mirror I just like to dot it around just so it's like all even and then I just start buffing I love this foundation it never dries out my skin it's just so good and it's not like crazy expensive as well like some other good foundations. Make sure it's blended around the neck because I do not need an orange face and a pale neck. <laughs> I couldn't think what way it was. I thought I was getting it wrong there. Um, eyebrows next I like to do my concealer last because I'm really bad at doing I'm really bad at doing my mascara will I do it in here or will I just do I need to get my eyebrows done actually they look so bad right now but they're okay they could be a lot worse there's just a few stray hairs, but sure. I'm only human. What do they expect from me? But, um, yeah, I'm just using the Catrice eyebrow pencil. It's very pared down. I don't actually know what shade it is. It's just the brownie one. I don't think they have a lot of shades, really. Where's my little mirror? I'm going to actually do it in the mirror, because I doubt I'd be able to do it on this, would I? I don't know. I can't really... I don't know what's that going out like. Well, it's actually okay, I suppose. I don't want to go like crazy on them. I use I'm kind of known for doing my eyebrows pretty intense, but I just want kind of like a natural, a more natural look. Cause I'm not doing anything too exciting. I'll do now what do I do oh yeah sorry for this hair band my hair is wet I'm just had to share it that's why I just pinned it back right what is next I feel like I'm like forgetting what I do next up I think I'll just put a little bit of eyeshadow in my crease just so I don't look like completely I don't know I'm gonna use blank canvas Ugh, I can't speak you'll get to know that I just can't speak in English the blank canvas cosmetics brush it's E25 on one end and then E26 on the other and that's not focusing oh well I like this end so what's the one what's this end E26 the white end uh, I'm gonna use the naked smoky palette it's 
smoky eye palette. Oh yeah. I'm gonna take the like the the white. Uh, I'm gonna take the shade 13, just a little bit on my brush. I'm just gonna put that all over the lid, just so there's no like darkness or little veins or redness or basically anything. Just for a base kind of thing. <sighs> then I'll take the one right next to it, Combust. I'm just gonna. Put that in the crease. Just to start giving a little bit of depth. To create kind of like a shadow effect. Is that the right word? Shadow? Mm, I don't know. Yeah, that, that works I suppose. Blend, blend, blend. I just do swirly motions or sometimes I get the other end of the brush which is E25. And just do big mad wind wiper motions because yeah I know works <laughs> and then I'm gonna take the one the third one in called whiskey I'll just take a little bit of that because it is a bit dark just a little bit in the, in the outer corner and the crease I feel like that'll do. I just need a little bit. Right, so eyeshadow is done for now. I will do. Yeah, I'll curl my eyelashes now. I'm just using a Penny's eyelash curler because I feel like they all do the same job, so why buy an expensive one? That's my model. <laughs> That's my motto. I didn't even realize I said that. I mean, that's my like thought process. Like, it's just a or it's just a little eyelash curler. So why do you need an expensive one? Right, yo. Oh, I'm not gonna be able to do this in the camera, am I? Should I try? I'm really bad at. Uh, mascara. I get it everywhere. Hence why I do my um, concealer last because I usually like it flicks down to my under eye. Actually, I think I'm happy enough with that. Then I have to go in with the end of the brush and just kind of pull the hairs up. Trying to do it as individually as possible. Just to make them stick out that little bit extra. And then will I do my bottom lash now? Yeah, sure, why not? While I'm at it, I just get the little residue or whatever else is left on the brush. And just go in and do my bottom lashes. Kind of like I'm like just dragging a pencil back and forth. And I spoke too soon when I got them under my eye lid. It's okay though. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. Right, yo. What's next? <laughs> um, what is next? I feel like I'm drawing a blank. Oh yeah, concealer. Duh. I love the eraser eye from is it Maybelline? Yes, I use the word, or the word, I use the um, shade light. Blah, blah, blah. Nope, it does not want to focus. Okie dokie, so let's have to take my word for it. The Razor Eye Perfect and Cover Concealer with Goji Berries. Goji Berries? Goji? I never know how to pronounce that. Instant Anti-Age. Hey, yeah. Wouldn't mind about that. So yeah, I do that and I under my eyes. 
because I always get like really pinky cheeks and it's really annoying that's why I kind of like drag it out a good bit but yeah you gotta do what you gotta do then I just go back in with my buffing brush that I used my foundation or that I did my foundation with and I just bounce it off my face I don't drag it anywhere because I don't want like streaks or I don't know my skin's really sensitive so I feel like that would just wreck it and I just buff like kind of in my cheekbones so it kind of blends good I'm happy enough with that next what's this called oh my god that is white powder that's what it is that's what it's called Leanne Rimmel London Stay Matte Long Lasting Pressed Powder mm 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 in this shade silky beige yes I'm gonna go in with the real techniques duo fiber face brush it's big it's poofy it's beautiful and I just powder my face Especially under my eyes where all the concealer is. I don't want that budging anywhere. Happy with that. Then I bronze. I take my Real Techniques powder brush. This big chunky one. <laughs> this big chunky one. And this bronzer that is donkey's years old it's I think it says NYC on it big bold bronzer or something I don't know yeah big bold bronze and powder hmm. it's all faded off on the front but it's good I'm gonna actually have to get a new one soon I hit pan on this for ages but like I'm powering true you gotta do what you gotta do start with the neck because I am a milk bottle so pale by nature and because Ireland well you don't really have a choice in Ireland so my ears and my forehead cheekbones neck jawline forehead Then I go in with a smaller Real Techniques brush. Real, te I feel like I'm saying that our ways. Real Techniques, Real Techniques, Real Techniques, Real Techniques. Right, that's enough, Leanne. This is the contour brush. It's a little bit smaller. I'm just going to go in with the same bronzer and just define my cheekbones. Or make it look like I have cheekbones. <laughs> Side of my nose. Put the excess everywhere. And then my favorite part. Highlighter. It's the Catrice one. It's the Catrice one that, I don't know. I didn't have it for that. Oh wait, I can kind of see it there. What's it say, Catrice? I think it's just the glow highlighter. I don't know, it's all faded off. But look at that. Ooh, beautiful. Highlighter born. Like, look. So shimmery. I don't think that's showing up on camera, but ooh, no point wasting it. Put that little bit on your face, Leanne. <laughs> but last but not least, another real techniques. <sighs> Why is it when I need to say it, I can't say it, and then uh, real techniques? 
although this is faded off too I think it's I don't know I think it's a contour brush but like the duo fiber one or whatever it's called when it has those things at the top pat some highlighter in and go to town down my nose the tip of my nose make it look like I have a small nose Yes. And I think we are done. Let me check. Thumbs up. So, that is all from me. If you enjoyed, give this video a thumbs up. Comment anything down below if you have any questions or what you use for your makeup that I should be using because I need all the help I can get. <laughs> yeah, if you like my videos, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to. You'll get to see this face then. Well, no, I was going to say every day, but not every day, but close enough. Anyway, I really enjoyed doing this video. Give this video a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you soon. Bye.